Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be sort of like a mini vlog slash nail tutorial. I ended up going to this girl that I found on Instagram and she was amazing. Her shop is called VIP Nail Lounge and she is in the Orlando slash Kissimmee area in Florida and she also is in Houston, Texas for those of you who are interested. I'm going to leave all her information down below. So in this video, we're going to show you how to use acrylic and gel on the same set of nails. We only did two nails for the sake of this video, just to teach you guys. And she started by cleaning my nails and pushing back my cuticles. And for that, she used a little bit of alcohol and just a regular cuticle pusher. She also gave me a mini Russian manicure that I love because it makes the final product look so much cleaner. Then she removed the shine from my nails, applied nail tips, and blended those nail tips to my real nails. She primed my nails and then she started with the acrylic application and for that she used this nude color. I honestly can't remember what it's called but in many of my videos I use a lot of different nudes that are pretty similar to this one. So. Um, I would say the closest one that I can remember off of the top of my head right now would be Warm Pink by C&D. So she's just molding the acrylic into an almond shape. You know, she's creating that almond for a French manicure that she's going to be doing later. And she's making sure the sides are super clean and that the curve is as clean and crisp as possible. And after the acrylic completely dried, I love that she took a nail file and she made sure that the edges were super crisp. I love that look. And now she's using this beautiful electric blue gel polish and she's just going over the corners and she's staying very close to that curve that she created um, with acrylic, the almond that she created with acrylic, and she's blending it out a little bit just so it doesn't look too stark. After she's done applying the gel polish, she is going to flash cure it for about 10, 7 to 10 seconds. Then she's going to apply a thin layer of builder gel on the free edge of the nails that she's working on and she's going to apply this gorgeous, guys, gorgeous electric blue miler that has iridescent to it and she did this for two reasons. One, because I gave her creative freedom and second, because she wanted to also teach you guys how to encapsulate using this technique. We cure this product for about 15 seconds under the lamp and then she added clock gears and because they're gold, they look so stunning against the blue, the electric blue color. I love the combination between gold and blue. It just looks so pretty and luxurious. So I love it so much, love, love, love. And then um, she encapsulated using the same builder gel that she used to apply the miler. She cured and she removed the tacky layer using 99% alcohol. If any of you guys are into that same combination of electric blue and gold, drop a blue heart in the comment section because I just wanna see how many of you guys are also on the same boat. Now it's just a matter of removing the excess using a hand file and you could also use an electric file. And she's also going to buff these nails out and um, I believe she sprayed the same 99% alcohol to remove all the, the extra dust and to clean the nails for the final um, layer of top coat. She cured the last layer of top coat and then she applied this super cute cuticle oil that was not only super cute but that smelled so good. And my loves, this is the final product. I hope you thoroughly enjoyed this video and that you learned a lot of useful tips and tricks that you can implement into your nail journey. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content like this. And don't forget to check out my previous videos where I have a lot of useful content that is completely for free. So make sure you guys check it out. I'll see you guys in my next video. And as always, may God bless you.